and welcome back to my channel so today I have decided to be very honest and transparent with you guys um so I hope you guys are ready get your you know let me go get my wine okay you get your wine I'm gonna get my wine okay <laughs> we're back with the wine okay so Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, if you are new here, welcome. If you're an old subscriber, welcome back. Do not forget to turn on your notifications so that when I do post, which I will be posting a lot, you guys will be able um, to see and get the notifications. So let's jump right into the video. Clearly, you guys can see by the title that we are going to be talking about why I left YouTube and... I'm back so I have to explain to you guys why I left in the first place okay so to start off I joined YouTube in 2016 about five years ago um, let me check yeah so my first ever video on YouTube was posted on August 16th 2016 um, I started my channel basically doing hair videos I used to do hair for people so when I had clients I would basically film the videos and then post them on YouTube so at that time it was just strictly hair tutorials um, braiding tutorials and you know things like that once in a while I will do like a hair video on myself and then talk about the hair but it was mainly tutorials on um, of braiding styles on my clients the first video that went viral was these jumbo braces I did on my client and I mean it went I think it had like millions of views. Um, then I had like other videos that had like 600K, you know, 50K. So I had a lot of hair videos that were doing really well on, on YouTube. So I kind of went viral. I gained a lot of followers. I think right now I'm at 61K um, subscribers. And once in a while, like I said, I will throw in other videos like my makeup tutorials and stuff like that. But again, my videos were strictly hair videos. At the time I was married, um, I was living with my ex-husband at the time, and I was doing hair from home. I had two kids, and you know, that was what I was doing. Um, I kind of fell off after I got a divorce, or after I left, however you want to put it. Um, whoo, girl. Okay. <laughs> That's when I kind of just fell off. Um, I had a lot going on. It was a lot happening. You know, I was on my own at this point with two kids. I think this was, it's been about five years now. Has it been about five years? I think it's been about four years. Four years since, yeah, it was, it's been about four years, almost five years. I'm not sure. It's been a while. Um, so I was on my own at this point. I was renting out somebody's basement. I literally picked up my kids and my stuff and I left and I was on my own and I went through some really tough times. So YouTube was the last thing on my mind. I was still braiding here and there, but it wasn't as much because at this point I was um, working at a daycare. So I had a lot going on and YouTube honestly was the last thing on my mind i was more focused on trying to figure out like where do i go from here how do i start my life back up you know like i went into a state of depression i did not want to be bothered like i was just your girl was out of it okay and mind you this was with two toddlers at the time at the time my oldest was i think he was one no not one sorry he was two almost three and then my youngest was one almost two um, again, I was renting out somebody's basement. I was working at a daycare. Once in a while, I will take a client and then, you know, or I will go to my own salon and then help her out and also trying to create content. Oh my God, what was it? The thing he said here. So yeah, and then I, I, you know, will try to create content for Instagram and it was just a whole lot trying to deal with all these things so i kind of fell off of youtube and decided to just 
focus more on myself i started creating makeup contents and then like you know hair tutorials all on myself and then posting them to instagram so i started getting like you know brand deals and working with brands and then later on down the line what when COVID happened i stopped taking clients because at this point the boys are home um doing homeschool and it was really difficult <laughs> trying to take a client and then having these kids at home and you know when they wake up and then your client is here it was it was really hard so i had to let that go but god being so good while i was letting that go my influencer or content creator i guess um, thing was taken off, so I was good. Um, what else? It was a lot trying to explain these things, girls. Uh, so yeah, I mean, I tried many times to get back on YouTube. I will create content here and there, but just I didn't have the the vim <laughs> to edit it and then post it to YouTube. So I was my my main focus was on Instagram, and that's what I was focused on. What else I got to tell y'all? I have a lot to tell y'all guys, but it's like I'm trying to I'm trying to wrap everything up in like a bubble so we're not here for hours. Um and then also I had to stop posting my clients because you know they will come in, I will let them know that hey, I'm filming this video for YouTube, you know, are you okay with it? Your face will not show. Sometimes it shows, but most of the times it won't show. They will say okay, but you know, as my videos were doing so well on youtube that meant a lot of people were seeing these videos and that also meant that a lot of people were being negative under these videos so you know i will post a video and then a client will text me hey can you take that video down because blah 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 and i have to respect that right so i was like you know what i'm just not going to post these videos anymore because I mean, I can't stop the internet from being a, the internet, right? People are always going to be negative. And like I said, these videos have like thousands and even millions of views and trying to go under the comments. And I, I didn't have time. So I was like, you know what? I'm just going to stop posting other people on my channel. I don't want to get sued and I don't want any problems. So I just moved on to creating content. Like I said, makeup content and just posting that on Instagram. So I hope that wraps up why I left. It was just a whole lot happening. And honestly, I did not think I was going to make it this far to be even sitting here explaining to you guys why I left in the first place. Because I was at a very dark, 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 dark place in my life. And glory be to God, we're out of there and we're doing so much better now. I am back on YouTube now, as you guys can see. Like I said, I was posting once in a while, like, you know, maybe a month or two ago, but I wasn't being consistent. I'm ready to be more consistent, and y'all pray for me and post as much as I can. Um, but these contents are going to be makeup contents. They're going to be skincare contents. They're going to be, you know, once in a while, family contents, because I do have two boys now. Um, they're going to be hair videos but the hair videos are going to be videos of myself i'm going to be doing my hair videos i will not have any clients on my youtube because again i don't want any problems i don't want people disrespecting other people if you disrespected me or insulting me whatever i can delete the comment i can leave it alone i don't care but we all don't have the same um we all mm -hmm. don't have the same i guess tough skin if that's what you want to call it for these type of things so i have to respect other people's wishes and just stay away from you know that so yeah i'm back that's all i have to say honestly i think i don't have anything else or more to add no I, I don't i mean i'm back you know i'm back and i'm back and i'm back for good and just i hope that you guys will keep watching my videos and supporting me and you know Help a sister get somewhere in life, you know, and we can only do that if you guys keep viewing our videos and communicating, liking, and, you know, sharing and all of those things. So I'm very excited for this new journey that I am on, and I hope that, you know, you guys will get to know me more, my personality. I'm a little crazy, you know, I'm a little, not crazy, but, but crazy, just. Just a little bit so you guys will get to know me better and get to know what I'm about and I'm excited so yeah that's why I left YouTube but I am back because what doesn't kill you makes you stronger and here I am stronger thank you guys so much for watching this video I really really appreciate it 
please go ahead and turn on your notification um, bell because I will be posting a lot more. And just subscribe and let's go on this, I guess, road trip together. Okay, thank you guys. Bye. See you in my next video.